Of the day, my name is Tomas Torres. I'm from the beautiful island of Guam, originally from Zonia and now staying in Jigo. Today, in celebration for a mess tomorrow, I'm going to teach you guys how to make a bird. And then tomorrow we call it Paluma. Alright, so the first thing we're going to do is, we're going to take the leaf here and then strip it from the new hood. Okay. Take my weaving tool here. This is called a CE. Alright, just slice that off there. It off and as you see we have two leaves okay, we're gonna pull that apart now with the first leaf we're gonna loop it like a ribbon then the next step we're gonna take the next leaf and we're gonna slide it inside the ribbon there like this then we take this leaf here and we're gonna wrap it around this bottom side leaf. So it's gonna come around the back, and then we'll wrap it around the loop. And you wanna hold it there so that it won't run away. Continue on, we're gonna take the long leaf here, and then we're gonna go in the center of the leaf and the loop, like this. Now, to lock it, we're gonna take this other leaf here, the back side. We're gonna go inside the loop and put it together with the other leaf, like this. And then from here, we're gonna slowly tighten the body of the bird. Like this. Now, next step, we're gonna start off with one leaf and we're gonna try and fold it <clears throat> inwards to make it look like a triangle okay now we want to crimp that there and we're doing the bird when you do one side <clears throat> don't forget to do the other side so we'll flip it around and do the same thing fold it inward like a triangle and we want to make sure that it's equal on both sides that it's the same then, on the top side here, we're going to flip it up to make the neck of the bird. And you want to crimp it so that it stays still. And then, also, flip it around and do the other side. Now, we've done the neck part, we want to do the, the head. So, to do the head, we're going to take the top leaf again, fold it inwards to make like another triangle. this and then again do it on the other side to be the same as the other side like this okay here comes the tricky part now the tricky part is you want to take the first leaf again you're gonna go over the head on the front side over around and you want to come backwards so that <clears throat> we can finish off the rest of the bird then again the next side here we're gonna go over around and back so now we pretty much got the head now we want to finish off first thing we want to look at one side has a lock other side does not so the first leaf we're going to use is the, the side does not have a lock that side the leaf we're going to go down under the other leaf then the next leaf I'm gonna wrap it over and down and then again lock no lock so always start off with the, the, the side that, that does not have a lock okay now for here we're gonna try and go around the neck on the bottom side we're gonna slide the leaf inside here this side here and it's gonna come out towards the middle wing part all right then the next step first off we need to cut a slit so that we can slide this leaf to lock it we use the CE again so a small slit there in the middle and then we're gonna slide it 
in inside this other leaf here and come out towards the slit that we just cut. And we form the front side of our bird. Now to finish off, you also got to do the tail. Okay, so the tail, I'm going to get a scissors here, trim it off a little bit. Alright, then again, we do one leaf here. We cut a small slit in the middle again. Try to get it closest to the body as you can. And then you take the other leaf, you're gonna go over the leaf inside the slit and slowly pull it and form it out to make it look like the tail of the bird. Now, we wanna finish off our wings for our bird. So what I usually do is I flip it upside down like this and I put the two leaves together. You want to pinch it to rip it and form the wings. Okay, we have our bird. Now if you want it to fly, you would take the new here. You want to make this edge here kind of sharp. So we take the scissors again, cut that there. And the top portion here, we're just going to tie um, a small knot so that when we put the, the bird through, it will hold the bird and it won't fly away. Now, from the bottom side of the bird, we're going to put the new hood through and try and poke a hole on the top side here. Then, just pull it all the way through. Yeah, you have your bird. You can also join us at the KUM Mesh Tomorrow uh, workshops at Punta Dos Amantes at Terraza every Saturday of the month. If you're not able to come up to, to the workshop, you can also find me at Sagan Katurin Tomorrow up the hill from Hilton Hotel. My workshops are every Saturday from 11.30 to 4.30. This month, we're going to be doing a little barbecue, you know, try out the katupa rice. If you haven't tried out the katupa rice with coconut milk, come on up. It's going to be fun. Adios!